What's up guys, I'm Alan here and um, today I'm showing a video of my uh, five and a half gallon that I am doing the dry start method with. Um, so first off, uh, two two days ago, I put in some baby tears from my friend's tank. They're just trimmings, so they they weren't rooted plants, but um, there was a good amount so I I could fill pretty much the entire place where I was planning on filling. Sorry, um, allergies are really bad today because um, it's incredibly sunny outside and all the trees and whatnot are pollinating and all that crap bugs the crap out of me. Makes my life miserable, school life, whatnot. Anyways, um, school is going out in six days, so summer here I come, and um, I'll probably be doing some projects in the summer, and I'm planning on getting a 125. Um, so stay tuned for that. Um, probably get that. Uh, maybe, hopefully, sometime in July. Um, but that's definitely a goal for me in the summer is to get a 125 and replace it with that 55 down there but um that span from the that shelf half wall thing to the next window is six foot span so it'll fit the 125 pretty much perfectly and um yeah so back on to this <clears throat> I'm pretty sure there has already been growth going on from the three two days that I've had it in here um but um yeah I think they they're doing really well don't know I don't think you guys could tell very much but um yeah, hopefully this whole place gets carpeted up. And um, these things, if you're wondering, are fizzins that I just put on onto some lava rock. Um, just because it's dry start and uh, they'll root on really nicely. Sorry. Um, and um, I can <clears throat> place them in my other aquascapes if I don't like them here. Um, since they'll be already covered and the red will go away or maybe that will be a nice touch but um anyways so that's about it for this video um next plants I'm planning on probably some pogo stem and hellfry or down noi as some of you know maybe um to go along here and then maybe some some uh other foreground plants and then in the back I'll still have the rotalas and uh, maybe something on the wood maybe not just leave it blank um, natural and um, yeah so tell me guys tell me tell me what you guys think of this tank and um, any suggestions on plants or anything of the matter um, please do so and I appreciate all you guys watching my videos and whatnot um, and to all you guys that are new um, if you haven't subscribed hit that button um, so uh, it'll give me more of a reason to uh, do these videos for you guys and uh, yeah so until next time I'll see you guys later peace